I first came here from working at Danielle for five years. You know, the, the style of the house is very defined. It's very, it's very linear, it's very specific, it's very structured. And then I came here and Mark is the opposite of that. He has a very different outlook on fine dining and I felt really like out of place. I had never studied Italian food. I had no idea what was going on. I had never cooked pasta before. So it definitely changed the way I think about food and the way I execute it. Like I've always been, I'm very technique driven and I, I still am. But I think that the way I go about things, I definitely have a much wider vision. I'm less likely now to be like, no, that is not the way that we're going to do this. You know, I'm, I'm a little more open to looking at things in another direction or from a different point of view. So that's been super helpful. The agnolotti with the Dungeness crab was meant as like an homage to one of our favorite pastas at spaghetti with Dungeness crab, but we just wanted to give it a little bit of a makeover and an update. But you know, when you, when you do an homage to someone, you don't want to just imitate what it is, but it needs to be as delicious, so it was, that was challenging. The thought of, you know, you're going to be reviewed in a restaurant is horrifying and exciting, um, but the thought of it being a four-star restaurant to start is equally horrifying and exciting. I have a lot of goals for the next year at Del Posto. I hope that we continue pushing the food forward, not only challenging myself, but my, my kitchen staff and my front of the house staff.